Good morning YouTube, our topic today is on DNA databases. As a summary, we will review the roles of DNA databases, which serve as collections of DNA profiles that are used for a variety of purposes, such as solving crimes, identifying missing persons, and investigating paternity disputes. The use of DNA databases is a complex issue that has generated a wide range of perspectives and opinions. Critics argue that the cost of collecting, analyzing, and storing DNA samples is prohibitively expensive. If you are new here, welcome, we are a group of retired professors sharing bite-sized videos in life sciences. Let's dive into the topic for today. Introducing DNA Databases DNA databases are collections of DNA profiles that are used for a variety of purposes, such as solving crimes, identifying missing persons, and investigating paternity disputes. The use of DNA databases has become increasingly prevalent in recent years, and has been hailed as a powerful tool for law enforcement and forensic science. However, the use of DNA databases is a complex issue that has generated a wide range of perspectives and opinions. Ability to solve crimes One of the main advantages of DNA databases is their ability to solve crimes. When a DNA sample is collected from a crime scene, it can be compared to the profiles in the database to identify a suspect. This is particularly useful in cases where traditional investigative methods, such as fingerprint analysis, have failed to yield any leads. Additionally, DNA databases can also be used to link crimes that were previously thought to be unrelated. Identify missing persons Another key benefit of DNA databases is their ability to identify missing persons. In cases where a person is missing, a DNA sample can be taken from a family member and compared to the profiles in the database. This can help to determine whether a person who was found dead or alive is indeed the missing individual. Paternity Disputes DNA databases can also be used to resolve paternity disputes. When a man denies fathering a child, a DNA sample can be taken from both the man and the child, and the samples can be compared to determine whether the man is the child's biological father. Privacy is a concern. Another perspective is that DNA databases raise important privacy concerns. Critics argue that individuals should have the right to control their own genetic information and that the collection and storage of DNA samples invades privacy. There are also concerns about the potential for misuse of DNA information by government agencies or private companies, which could lead to discrimination or other forms of mistreatment. Additionally, it's also argued that some people might be more likely to have their DNA in the database, such as people of color or low-income individuals, which can lead to racial or economic bias. Issues that matter DNA databases are not foolproof and could have the potential for wrongful convictions given historical examples. In some cases, DNA evidence may be mishandled or misinterpreted, leading to the conviction of an innocent person. This highlights the importance of proper training and education for those who handle DNA evidence, as well as the need for strict protocols for the collection, analysis, and interpretation of DNA samples. Resource Intensive DNA databases are too costly and time-consuming to be practical. Critics argue that the cost of collecting, analyzing, and storing DNA samples is prohibitively expensive and that resources would be better spent on other forms of investigation. Additionally, it's argued that the process of DNA analysis can be time-consuming and that the results are not always reliable. Concluding Remarks In conclusion, DNA databases are powerful tools that can be used for a variety of purposes such as solving crimes, identifying missing persons, and investigating paternity disputes. Supporters argue that DNA databases are a valuable tool for law enforcement and forensic science, while critics raise concerns about privacy and the potential for misuse of DNA information. 
Thus, it's crucial that DNA databases be implemented and administered in an ethical and responsible manner.